So we got a slow drain in our house. This is my uh, main bathroom sink. And this um, particular sink right here is usually... I'm going to fill it up with water real quick and then turn it off so you can hear me. As you can see, the water's filling up right here. It's not a complete clock, but this is um, it's a slow drain. Um, it happens every couple of months, and we gotta clear it. I use it. I use this all the time. But this is liquid plumber. It's a uh, Clorox liquid plumber. It um, it'll cure block drains, slow drains, and safe on all pipes, metal or plastic. So as you can see, it's really really slow. And how how this works for me, and it works all the time um, so far, is I let it drain. And then I have to leave it overnight for um, for the pipes to completely dry out. After um, usually it's at least ten hours for me. After it dries out, I pour this in. If it's a slow drain, this is a slow drain. It's not a completely clogged drain. I use half. And if it's um, if it's completely clogged, then I use the whole bottle. But I use half, and I wait for about fifteen minutes. On here it says ten minutes. So I always wait a bit longer. Fifteen minutes. Wait for fifteen minutes, and then. Um, and then turn on your hot water and flush it through and let the water run through for a few minutes. At least. For me, I leave it on for five minutes just to make sure. And it flushes all the debris down, all of um, the soap scum, your uh, makeup, your toothpaste, everything. It flushes down and it should be good to go again. So this is you get this from Sam's Club, $10 for five or six of them. If they're $2 each. Uh, there's usually two reasons why your sink would be, um, would be slow if there's a clog. This will most likely solve it. If um, it's hair, then there's a snake. You can lift this up and then uh, get a two-dollar snake and just pull in and out, in and out, and then get that hair out. Um, try that. If that doesn't work, then you got to call a professional plumber. But that's going to cost at least 150 for the estimate and to see what's wrong with it. We haven't used this uh, the sink for 10 hours. It should be pretty dry right now. We're going to pour this in, it says half a bottle for a slow drain and a full bottle for a clock drain and leave it for 10 minutes. This is only a slow drain, but since it takes so long for us to uh, go through this process because we use the sink so much, we're just going to go ahead and pour the whole thing in just to make sure we clean it all up. So we pour it in and this is what it looks like. And we're just going to leave it like this for 15 minutes. And when I come back, I'm going to pour boiling water in it. It's been sitting for 15 minutes now. What we're going to do is we're going to close it up. Fill it up with hot water and only use hot water. Now I got a kettle over here. This is boiling hot water. I just use it um, in addition to the hot water. <laughs> see, as you can see before, the drain didn't go down, uh, it was really slow. 
but now it's a lot better. And that's it. Um, I'm gonna leave it. I'll turn it back on once we're done recording for a couple more minutes, but this is how you do it. Um, if it's a slow drain, or even if it's a complete stop, try this first. I threw the I threw the bottle away, but try that first. You can get it for two, three dollars. I got it in a bulk, so it was only two dollars each. And I use it two times, roughly two times every year, just to clear my uh, main sink out. And yeah, try that first before you call a plumber that might charge you 100, 200, 300. I don't know, depending on your area. That's it.